entrepreneurial people uh, think about alternative solutions. Creative people are good at spotting those problems, aren't they? They always notice those things, they see them, and they don't have one idea. Creative people have lots of ideas. And you can always tell a really creative person because they won't have one idea that is the same idea a few times. They'll have lots of different, very, very different ideas and look at ways to solve problems in this sort of creative breadth of thinking. There's been a lot of talk about whether creative people are born or bred, where, from what I understand, you can be born to be more or less creative, but you can certainly learn to become more creative. A little bit like a person, perhaps like myself, who needs to diet. I could learn to lose a little weight. Creative people can learn to be more creative. So to think creatively, we should stop thinking of uh, what it is. Instead thinking, what could it be? Maybe. Yes. So it's cool, we should ask children more questions like, why, what if, I wonder. Mm. And that could promote their creative thinking, and I guess. And imagine. Just yes. lots of different answers. Imagine those things. Yes, of course. And do you know the oldest creative exercise? No, I don't think I do. Please tell me. So take a clothes hanger or any other simple object and ask your children, uh, can you just think of as many different uses of this object as possible? So really, quantity is important, not quality in this case. And uh, just uh, wait how many different uses you will see. Children can be really very creative in this simple exercise. I agree with that. Have you ever tried asking them what they can't do with a coat hanger? Ah, because yes. when you actually say what you can't do, they suddenly realise that you know there are many things that they hadn't thought of. For example, I have heard a story, now you've told me, where someone said you can't drink with a coat hanger. So the teacher picked up the plastic bottle, pierced it with a coat hanger, and took the drips <laughs> and drunk using the coat hanger. It's a very creative exercise. Yes, it's uh, very nice and it's like uh, reverse brainstorming. Absolutely. That is a very nice yes. exercise for children.